the meeting here at the summit is, is a fascinating way of bringing everybody together to make sure we can really discuss the right problems. So the university is about making sure that we fill the gaps of where are the technologies that industry doesn't do today. We shouldn't be trying to compete with the industry. We should look at where are the gaps, where we can do this, is it in perception, is it mechanics, is it gripper design, and then work with uh, the industry and work with the manufacturers to make sure that we get an integrated product. Um, it's really unique from an investor standpoint to be at a primarily grower-driven um, conference because it gives us a customer perspective that we just don't normally get because we're usually hearing it from the entrepreneur. Um, so it's nice to hear from the concerns of those growers themselves. Yeah, so I select, um, we're, we're an early stage venture capital firm, so we do primarily investments across food, agriculture, and healthcare, um, from sort of the C through Series B stage. Um, so where we want to be most helpful for, particularly on the agriculture side, is providing capital at the earliest stages. But the, the idea here is that you have this really unique engagement of technology and, 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 and customer um, that you don't normally get in this kind of engagement early on, particularly in agriculture where adoption might be slower. The robotic group, our main interest here is to provide solutions that we're creating in our uh, areas to support our own factories and be able to offer them into uh, the automation for strawberries and in general of working with the farmers and getting an understanding of what goes into bringing something from the field to the supermarket. I think you know the thing with something like automation is you know it's it's really in its it's, it's relatively early stages and there's a lot of stuff happening relatively quickly, but it's it's distributed across a lot of companies and a lot of places, and I think there's the potential to sort of bring a lot of learning that wouldn't otherwise necessarily uh, you know, intersect into one place and, and is coming together, um, and you know can envision a, a, a future where we can solve these problems. Uh, Octin is the developer of uh, Rubium, uh, the first commercial strawberry picking robots. Uh, where we focus on picking strawberries in, uh, in tabletop systems. I think it's really interesting to have the, uh, the panel talks, discussions. Uh, I think that helps a, a lot. Um, it's very, uh, it, it triggers debates uh, during the panel but also afterwards. So I think that that's a, a, major, a major advantage. Cloud computing is bringing the ability to scale out a single machine over multiple machines. So it's allowing the industry to look at larger groups of data and process it for decision making faster. One unique attribute to a strawberry is once you pick it, you, you gotta get it moved, right? It, it, it tends to, to, to deteriorate faster than a lot of other crops, in fact, most other crops. So that, the speed to market from when it's picked is an important part of the process, and being able to design the back end in such a way that, that you can address those needs um, as they come up, I, I think that's a big part of this whole process. Really diverse disciplines coming together and sharing ideas. You always get an infusion of new information, new ideas, and to get those minds talking to each other. Uh, only good things can come from that. Very exciting time. Uh, a lot of changes are happening, but I think ultimately it, it breeds new life and new optimism into the industry.